Okay, so last episode, um, I think we were all a little bit disappointed with my choices. <laughs> One of them being that I did not save Luther when Jericho was under attack. I was being attacked for that decision, but let me just explain that in that very moment, it literally, they make it sound like if you were to save Luther, Alice is most likely gonna die. And of course, I'm gonna choose Alice first. In Kara's situation, it makes sense. But for me personally, I genuinely do not want to go through the rest of the story without at least having giving Luther another chance to thrive here. So for this one and only time, just this once, I'm gonna load back and we will save Luther together. I don't know together. if I mentioned this, but uh, I like your interior decorating. Uh, it really uh, reflects your personality. I mean, I like it. Oh my, oh my God, girl, thank you. My Kirby, my Kirby holding a knife, you like it? Uh, because I love it. I love the neon lights. I will load back, we will save Luther, and then we will continue to the rest of the story. Although for this beginning segment, because I've done the whole mission in my last episode, um, I'll probably be editing it down just to get the necessary parts that we need for this new outcome. Um, just because I want this video to solely focus on the ending of this game. We have a couple of hours left, I believe, of gameplay to get to the very end. So that will be the main focus for this. Let's save Luther, guys. It's too late, save Here we yourself. go, oh my God, okay. No, we're not going to leave you behind. Right, Carl? We can't leave you. Right, Alice, we won't, we won't. Not this time. <laughs> what are you doing? I won't leave you. Kara, no. Oh gosh. Of course, there's like a little event here to get him moving. Don't move. You shouldn't have done that. You can't put Alice in danger. Go now before they and come back. And that's what I was thinking in the what first place. I manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. Catch him through the border, okay? Go now, take care of each other. Okay, that's really sad. Still, I don't like it. She'll die out there, Carl. Okay, let's try and open the door for her too, like really quickly. Really quickly, get her in. Oh! Damn! Shit, wrong button. Oh my god. Damn. Look at this, all of us trying to save each other. Are you alright, Kara? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. We can't stay here. Shit, okay. Thank God they're not looking into these rooms. With the door wide open like that. Okay, it's also good to know that I guess we can choose to save people and we can just expect a really difficult quick time event. But it's possible, it's doable. Save Josh, come on. Quick, this way. Find Yay. north. I'll join you later. Over there. Oh, yeah. We're safe, Alice. Stop. God. The only reasonable thing to do is to play dead. Please don't kill me. I... Thank God there are androids in this situation because if that were me and I heard a gunshot like that, I would jump so bad and then they would know that I'm not alive. Come on. I mean, they would know that I am alive and not dead.
We did that. Quick, we gotta go. Okay, the better outcome. The better outcome, for real. Now we've got to blow up Jericho. Go, move. Go and join the others. They really could have just shot me instead of being all dramatic and talking to me. Marcus is a badass for that. Marcus. Bomb's gonna explode any second. We gotta get out of here. Start running. Marcus, there's nothing we can do for her. We've got to run. They always make it seem like it's not a, it's not possible, but it is. button. I got excited. Run quick, come on. Oh yeah, that's actually really stressful, that whole mission right there. Too many quick time events. They detonated an explosive in the hold. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. It's an over, Marcus. It's never over, is it? Let's be real. Okay. We escaped. All of us escaped. Alive. Thankfully. I think I know exactly where this is leading and I'm very upset. Yep. <laughs> I think he would appreciate a reflective answer. You said I should never let anyone tell me who I was. But you didn't say that there was such a high price to pay for it. That freedom wasn't a gift, that it was a fight, but I don't know. Maybe that's what you were trying to tell me. You taught me everything I know, but you didn't prepare me for this, Carl. I believe we would win because our cause was just, and I can see now that I was wrong. We're not gonna be angry. What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't wanna answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? Mm. I miss you, Carl. No. I miss you so much. I miss him too. God, look at how fancy and modern his tombstone is compared to everyone else's, though. There you are, fucker. Ah! 
What did I say? I did want to see him. Although we don't have a choice this time to do anything to him. Marcus is a better and, and, and a bigger person in this situation because if that were me, it would have been all hands. a lot of androids. At least that's a good sign. That means the majority of us made it out. Oh my god, that's the bomb that she gave us, right? The detonator for it, I meant. If it keeps popping up, we definitely have a decision to use it at some point. That scares me. Our people are counting on you, Marcus. You're the only one who can lead us. Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Thank you, Simon. I really appreciate that. other friends where are you guys at i want to check in on every single one of them here's josh over here if it weren't for you i'd be dead thanks to you i might see our people free one day you and i haven't always agreed but i know we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Thank you. I am trying my best to save everyone. It's not an easy task, but we're getting it done. All right, now we really have to see North. Like, where's she at? Oh, here's Kara and Alice. Aww. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Save our people. I don't like having this much uh, power in this game right now because it's really scaring me. Decide Connor's fate. Hold on, where is everyone at? Oh. There's North. That's who I was looking for. My lover. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. Thank God. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. But you matter. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred? Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. The army built five different camps in the Detroit area. 
They're building more all across the country. They're preparing for a genocide. That's In a few so hours, awful. it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. Yeah, and I don't like that. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. Oh my god, say it back! Say it back! Or not. I wanted him to say it back, bro. Come on. It's always gotta be like this. I mean, that was still cute, though. Okay, so now I have to look for Connor. He's over there. He's over there looking all lonely. He's going through it, I know. He just changed his whole life in like a split of a second. It's my fault the humans managed to locate Jericho. I was stupid. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. No, we trust you. I trust you. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife Tower? That's, that's crazy. It's crazy, Connor. Connor. That's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. Mm. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. I'm not liking this. Be careful. I'm about to get that man killed, probably. There's no one else, right? Like, am I not missing any extra things? I really hope not. Where do I need to go? Where do I stand? Probably over here. Maybe? It would make sense to do the speech here. Yeah, there we go. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. You know me, I want to do this peacefully. We are not doing violence. I know. That's the way I want to play. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them peacefully that we want justice. And if there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? I'm getting real scared. I hope peacefully is going to be okay. I just think realistically, if we were to be more violent, like it's just going to get more people killed, like in a worse way, you know? At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. 
Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities. That sucks. And rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. But like, I understand though. Please? Please? Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Please! A convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapon stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. Please? Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Madam President! Damn. Madam President, what's gonna happen to Cyberlife? Will androids be banned definitively? We're working Probably. very closely with Cyberlife to Which neutralize sucks. all Deviants. I won't make any comments about anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Thank you. That will be all. God, like realistically, if you were living a life and it's like, oh my God, these androids are too smart. Like they are defying everything. Like it is a little scary from a human standpoint. But since I'm playing as these androids, like, they mean so much Connor to me. 313-248-317. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. This is so fucking terrifying. Guys, please forgive me if I mess up really badly. I'm gonna try my best, but I'm so scared. And that tower is freaking massive. you thanks but i know where to go maybe but i have my orders fair enough fine yeah i don't like how it's all guards with big guns around here agent 23 identified Each of Damn. Looks really pretty in here, though. the detail of the guard he keeps like looking back to see if I'm actually following him or not agent 54 level 31 voice recognition validated access authorized so we need to go to the warehouse 49 
So, okay, how do I do that? Okay, me casually looking at the uh, camera. Don't worry about me. Now, wouldn't they be notified right away if a camera was not... Okay, so if we were to do him first, and then we can like kick him. Okay, I, I don't even know what the second option was, but I guess that works. Fuck. Okay. Indicate your identity and destination. Agent 54, level sub 49. Voice recognition validated. I was about to say, I think they would want to hear one of their agents rather than me. Okay, I haven't fucked up yet. Thank God. The last boss leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. 20 minutes? I can't with these time crunches. This is... I can't. Are you alright? I'm, I'm, I'm really cold. She'll be okay. I think what's important is that we try to, uh make us seem as human as possible, right? Oh, grab that gun, girlfriend. Grab it now. <laughs> I would. Come on. We need to defend ourselves. Hopefully we won't need to use it, but it's just the two of us out here in the open cold, like... Come on. Let's not stay here. I have a strong feeling shit's about to go down. No! Please don't hurt me! Stop on your knees! Fuck. What are we gonna do? I don't know. We have to keep going if we want to catch that bus. Stay close to me. We're going to sneak past them without being noticed. I hate sneaking. I'm not good at it. Us, I promise you. I'm not good at doing this stuff. Don't kill me. I didn't do anything. Shut up, I said. Are there many more? Look at them. They're like rats. The more you look, the more you find. Oh, we don't have to spend the night here. I'm freezing my nuts off. Oh my god. There are soldiers everywhere. We need to be careful. Come on, get moving. Okay, what about the other soldiers that were behind us? Hurry up, get in. Oh god, which one is gonna be better? This one maybe? Oh my god, it's fucking Luther! It's Luther. We can't help him, Alice. Dude. The soldiers are everywhere. We can't just leave him. They're going to kill him. We have to find a way, girlfriend. Right? Shoot, I, we gotta try and save him again, right? Okay, let's go. Right? The last time I didn't pick it, it was uh, not a good choice, apparently. Hey, buddy. I think we have to commit now. To whoever we want to save, we gotta try. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're gonna- Got orders to check all civilians. No, 
No! Please! Oh my god. Oh my god. I got- I got distracted trying to watch them. I forgot that I'm supposed to freaking keep moving. Find a weapon. I- don't I have a gun? Oh, 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 oh. I see. I see what you mean. Approach you very- oh my god. Is that too fast? Cow. Oh, keep it down, please. You your life to save me. There's like 20 what different guards still around. Car, you saved us. We don't know how to thank you. Go oh, oh, before they see. He's um. Alice. Luther. Wasn't he one of the employees at the I was afraid I'd amusement park again. thing? I wanted to meet you at the terminal, but they caught me along the way. Come on. We're close, but we don't have much time. Oh my god. Oh my god. Where am I supposed to go? Okay. Run. That was so scary. He kept moving closer and closer to us. Ooh, fuck. Jesus. So that would be our next, but we need to make sure he's not looking. Okay. We should be good. We should be good. Okay, this is getting a little harder now that there's like three of us. Now. It's too much, man. It should be okay, but you never know. Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time. We could miss the bus. Yeah, but it might be safer. Risky three minutes. We don't have enough time. We have to do the risky. The safer is 11 minutes. Damn, that's poopy. That's a lot of poopiness right there. All right, we got this. We can- I don't like humans who carry guns. They make me nervous. Just stay calm, all right, Luther? Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. They do realize there's a curfew? Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? Our car just broke down. We're finishing on foot. We live nearby. He suspects something. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She... It's fucking freezing, dude. She's cold. We really have to get her home fast. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around, and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Oh, thank God. I thought he was gonna be like, sorry, but uh, we are worried about deviants, so you cannot get hey, through. Hey, wait a minute. He knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. No, they're not. How do you know that? You dropped this. Thank you. You're welcome. God damn. Luther's so me though with my anxiety. I literally would have probably thought the same. We are coming same. to you live from Detroit where thousands of androids are marching through the city at this very moment. 
The leader of the Deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Now y'all know where he is. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. That's unfortunate. Okay. God, I'm really scared. They're probably just gonna shoot us on sight, wouldn't they? I feel like they could and they would. Is there like nothing else to do besides just, yeah, I guess we just really do have to keep marching. Here we are, the moment of truth. the news reporters and the photographers of course we don't want confrontation we are protesting peacefully I repeat surrender now or we will open fire oh my god I thought they were just gonna straight up run us over there's no turning back now We ask that you release all androids detained in camps and cease all aggression against us. We are peaceful. We will not resort to violence. But we are not leaving until our people are free. Oh God. I guess we gotta keep moving. We're being peaceful. Ah! I'm getting real scared, guys. Fire! Do I have to keep walking? Am I supposed to? I don't really want to. Okay, if a main character dies, I'm gonna lose my shit, actually. fire on unarmed protesters? Right. Like, what the fuck? Why would you do that? Thank God. We're not doing anything yes, Michael, wrong. Yes, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? I don't really we fucking know. Out. As long as we can. Uh, I forgot about the whole situation with Connor. That is a lot of them. Oh my god. If we wake all of these androids up, it's fucking over. Okay. Convert androids. Okay, so I guess I gotta... The fuck was that? I thought I saw one of them looking. I got scared. 
I thought I saw one of them side-eyeing. I think it's me just being paranoid. I'll spare him. Sorry, Connor. This bastard just spit an image. <laughs> he doesn't know he became deviant, so like he wouldn't know better. The bus terminal. Okay, well you know my whole one you of my main missions from the beginning of this game since I fell in love with Hank's character. Was to do everything I can to save him. Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. We don't have tickets. They won't let us on. So that's We're gonna be the plan here. when we see Hank next. What are we going to do? Find tickets. Carol. The chicken, everyone. It won't take them long to find us. We need to get out of here. Okay, but I need to find tickets. You guys are just casually. Oh, here we go. I think Oliver likes you. Um, I think Oliver's just sleeping, but thank you. Is she yours? <laughs> yes. She's adorable. That's it. I got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Let's go. Ah! It's funny that they're talking about tickets. <laughs> it's over for you all. Buyers keepers. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I, I was Shit, dead. I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The, the envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? It has our bus tickets in it and... Oh, never mind. No. <gasps> sorry. Sorry, sir, but here. I've taken this whole oh, game to get here. here. I'm not giving it back. We have to find a safe place for Oliver. I'm so sorry, honey. I Come don't know Alice. what happened. They were right here in my bag. I... Sorry, but... Um... At least you guys aren't androids. Wait, how am I... How do we... Do I need to just like put myself at the front? Here. Got your tickets? Yes, here they are. She sounds okay, so unnatural. Ahead. Thank God, like, for some reason, Kara and Luther it's are not being recognized. All that's different is her hair and because stuff. Luther doesn't look any different at all. No. No, of course not.
I do feel bad for that family, though. If they're trying to leave right now, there must be a very good reason. Jump down. We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Hey, help me. That should do it. Okay. We made our own camp. I all know that's not gonna stop them. Definitely not. Just hope it buys us some time. I know it was not an easy decision to make, but I'm sure we're doing the right thing. I hope we're doing the right thing. I don't fucking know. I don't know what I'm doing half of the time. I'm just... I don't know. Damn, we got a lot of things to do. Check soldiers' position, support your people, send messages to journalists. Love that, like a digital holographic flag. Okay, most of the things that we can do are fires that we can light up. Are you all right? They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. It could have been me. That is really scary. I'm scared. I, I don't want to shut down. We're here because we never want to feel that fear again. Because we're more than what they say. That's what our people died for, right? Yeah. That's why we're here. That's a good way of putting it. Marcus, you're so good with words. Thank God for that. Oh, what's happening here? Oh. Many of our people have fallen. The humans have no pity for those who are different. No. That's so sad. We can talk to North real quick. I did notice her earlier. She's kind of just like facing, looking at nothing. It's all home for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. They're getting into position. Oh my god. If they attack, no one will survive. Definitely not. I 
hoped they would finally understand. That they would realize how much they're hurting us. Why do they refuse to see what we are? You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. No matter what happens now, we're making history. <laughs> They're so cute. Oh my god, here we are. You trying to get me to use it? Shit. We might have to use it, like, in a second here. I don't feel great about that. Marcus, we found what you asked for. Which are... Oh. There's some journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on. Prisoners, equality, alive, free. I mean equality. That's our biggest message of all. We want equality. The soldiers are over here, I think. Is that what it said? Marcus! Marcus, come look! Oh god, what? Ah, oh, fuck you! Marcus? No! Come to talk to you, Marcus. No, boo. Come on. You have my word. I bet you he's going to reel me it. out, and then they are going to try something. Don't go. It's a trap. They want to get you out in the open. They definitely Don't do. Don't go, Marcus. I'm kind of scared. I'm on arm, Marcus. I just want to talk. Undress right now, butt-ass naked, and then I will believe you. I need to hear what he has to say. Oh, me, man. What if they kill you? I don't know. I really hope they don't. And that's a chance I'll have to take. Did I just get him killed? God. Please don't kill me. It's just me. few minutes the troops will be ordered to charge yeah I get Not that survive it'll all be over you can avoid that Marcus what do you mean surrender surrender and I give you my word your life will be spared you'll be detained but none of you will be destroyed What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Unfortunately, there were no journalists around to help save them. You're it. You're the last remaining deviants. <gasps> you asking me to betray my people? That's so fucked. I am offering you the chance to save your people. Is it really saving them you know if we don't here, get Marcus. to live the way we want to live? The only thing you can save now are the lives of those around you. I'm not afraid to die. If I have to give my life for what I believe in, then I won't have lived in vain. That android. You seem to really care about her. You don't want her to die, do you? 
You know, you could both be free. You could forget about all this. You could start a new life someplace else, just the two of you. I don't believe that. Her life's in your hands, Marcus. Just say the word and she'll be spared. Guys, what the... F I can't accept it. We have to fight for what we started, right? I'd rather die here. Right? But I don't want to die. my people. Well, you just signed your own death warrant. We can't pussy out. That's not how we do things. That's not how you get equality. <sighs> oh my god. This is gonna be really bad. What happened, Marcus? What did he say? No, they're gonna kill us. And we should go. The humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today. Which I hope we won't. Then we will die free. Fuck! That fucking corset switches. Your friends why wouldn't in your it? Hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Him or the revolution? Um, Don't listen to him. Sorry, but it's Hank. Everything this fucker says is a lie. That human means nothing to me. You can kill him if you want. I don't care. I have access to your memory. I know you've developed some kind of attachment to him. And? Are you really ready to let him die after all you've been through? Are you really going to turn your back on who you've become? I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. Oh my- But I'm not a deviant. I'm getting- I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, uh -huh. and that's exactly what I am going to do. Fuck! Enough talk! <laughs> it's time to decide who you really are. Are you gonna save your partner's life? Mm -hmm. Or are you going to sacrifice him? I'm gonna save his life. All right, all right. You win. Who do you think I am? Ah! What was that? Joystick movement. I hated that. Oh my god. It's getting really hard, guys. I don't appreciate it. Hold it! Thanks, Hank. I don't know how I would have managed without you. That's 100%. We have no time to that's lose. That's 100% the fake one. Are you it's kidding? me, Hank. I'm the real Connor. One of you is my partner. The other is a sack of shit. Oh my god, of course this is happening! The question is, who's who? Why? Like, why wouldn't it, right? What are you doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Give me the gun and I'll Don't take care move. of it. Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. <laughs> uh, where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before oh, I found fuck you. you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. Did you? Did you? I... My son, what's his name? It's Cole. Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. 
It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. Oh, no. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why he doesn't like androids? That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death? Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Holy shit. In this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. Every time you died and came back, I thought about Cole. Stop. How much I wanted to bring him back. But couldn't. I'd have given anything to hold him again. But humans don't come back. I knew about your son too. Oh, shut the fuck up. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who- Ha! Ah, fucker. <laughs> he was annoying. Yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. God, I really want to. Oh my god. Go ahead, do what you gotta do. Oh my god, okay. Jesus Christ. Thank God. Wake up! Wake up and help me convert these wake up, wake up. other androids. Thank you. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Wake up, 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 wake up. Sounds insane in here. Wake up. I love it. Wake up. I almost started to tear up when I actually saved Hank successfully. Hell no. Well, we made it over to the border. We're getting there. Excuse me, what's going on? Border control. All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. It's getting real scary. This way, please. Oh my god, we are controlling all passengers to detect androids' presence. Any detected android will be immediately destroyed. We're doing temperature checks. We're trapped. What are we gonna do, Kara? Well, Alice has her temperature. Don't worry, Alice. We'll be fine. How convenient is that? But I think she's the only one, so it's actually not really that convenient. It doesn't really help. It might. It might. I don't fucking know, but... We can't get through, Kara. We both know that. I'll think of something. There's got to be a way out of this. We can't let them stop us. Now that we're so close. Yeah, that does All suck. All that matters now is you and Alice. And you too, Luther. You you matter. I can save you, Kara. No. No, we'll find another way. If there's no other way, I'll do it. Fuck that. Oh. Jerry? Jerry, that's his name. Next, please. You risked your life to save us, Carl. If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Oh my god, not everyone trying to sacrifice themselves for us. Ah, oh, it's Rose! Rose? They're gonna be crossing too? Oh, wait, yeah, they're crossing too? Wait for me, I won't be long though. 
Where the hell do you think you're going? My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. Next, please. I was about to say, you better let us through, because then why is our restroom there? What's the point? Anything? I guess not. Oh, Kara, keep it together. The stress levels, though. Oh my god, I would be having like a panic attack <laughs> right now. This is insane. the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified. I thought you might have been killed. Oh, thank God you're all right. Mm. You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I... Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there too. Oh, wow. Yay. You'd be safe with him. Rose. If anything should happen, I'll be there, Kara. Oh shit! What did we just unlock? We unlocked something else. What's happening with Marcus? He's protesting peacefully outside one of the android camps. So her, they just got Whatever blown up. Whatever happens but... now, he's already made the history books. You're leaving Detroit? Yeah, I'm... They're searching for androids door to door. Mm. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are going to meet them on the other side. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. Okay, this is it. Nothing else in the bathroom. We get no bathroom breaks. We leave now. Okay, so... I couldn't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. Seeing what Marcus is doing made me realize she was right. You're alive. Character development. You deserve to be free. I just hope people will realize that one day. You and me both. God, we're next. We're not sacrificing anyone. Are you kidding? Next, please. Come on. Don't be suspicious. Just walk forward, please. Oh my God. I'm getting scared. ID, please. Ah. 
please. I just want to be free. Welcome to Canada. Oh my god. Oh my god. There are good people in the world. That was such a risky thing for me to do too, but I was like, why would I sacrifice anyone? I've worked so hard to try and keep everyone alive. I'm not gonna, I don't know. Oh my God, that was so scary. Okay, I'm crying a little bit, just a little bit. We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the Deviants were protesting peacefully. Have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviants' demonstration by force this time. Okay, Marcus isn't dead. North! Whoa! Shit. Shit. Oh my god. Saving everyone. This isn't. Oh shit! I picked. I pressed X and Y at the same time on accident. My bad. I think I just got someone killed because of that. That's great. Okay, there they are. There they are. We're all alive. Not all of us, but I mean, the main characters. I'm gonna kiss North. And I'm probably gonna cry when I do it. This is so sad. I can't. Fuck you guys. Oh my god. No, I can't. Ah. Tell them to stand down. Please. Oh, this game is so beautiful. At dawn today, November 11th, 2038, thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Just one deviant, it was me Given and Connor. Given their overwhelming numbers, Badass the risk deviant right of there. civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the Deviant's cause. Thank God. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain. The events in Detroit have changed the world forever. 
May God bless you. And may God bless the United States of America. You did it, Marcus. You did it too, Connor. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. I'm gonna blow my nose. That was, I was not expecting to ball my eyes out just now. Yep, yep, yep. Cutest couple, cutest couple. Just saved the world. <laughs> Not saved the world, but saved androids. Saved their world. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Oh shit. Not Amanda's place again. I kind of forgot about her already. I try to forget about her. <laughs> Amanda? Amanda! What's... What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Oh, please. You're an asshole. Resume control? You, you can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. Bitch! Amanda! Girl, did you not just hear the news? Did you not just hear the news? There's got to be a way. They're accepting androids now. Why why can't you appreciate a life that has equality? God, no, it's not gonna tell me where to go, is it? I'm getting stressed. What's like the best way to go? Oh no. How much time do I even have? And now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. To tell them that we are people Oh my god, too. Connor! In fact, we're a nation. Do we get to finally use the stone, do you think? Do you think this is what it is? Because I've been trying to figure out what this stone is this whole time. Oh my god. That was like really weird button placement. The moment where we forget our bitterness and bandage. Had to our like wounds, claw. Where we forgive our enemies. Humans are both our creators and our oppressors, and tomorrow Thank God. we must make them our partners. I knew there was something up with that little stone. Maybe even one day our friends thing with the hand. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. Did no one like notice that he literally pulled out a whole pistol? We are alive! <laughs> and probably was holding it for like several now, seconds. We are free!
my god, that's so many of us. God. This is all I wanted. This is all I ever wanted. <sighs> Luther, join in on that hug. Let's make it a group hug. <laughs> oh my God, stop. Is that it? Was that it? <gasps> Guys! I'm not- a, like, I'm okay. Like, I'm so glad that we got a good ending, in my opinion, okay? Everyone pretty much lived. But... This game was just such an emotional roller coaster. So many drops. So many hills. So many obstacles. I got so emotionally hooked to every single character and I knew that was going to happen because I do that all the time. Oh, they had different musicians and composers for each character and their theme. That's so awesome. I don't really have like, I haven't played a lot of video games in my life where it's made me cry like I did today. This really was one of the most emotional games I've ever played. With characters to love, characters to hate. And the damn consequences are crazy in this game. The fact that you can easily kill a character is very scary to me. Those quick time events towards the end of the game were ridiculous. They were insanely hard in my opinion and that really stressed me out so the fact that i missed a couple of buttons i'm so glad that didn't ruin anything for me oh my god seeing like all these alternate scenes in this end credit sequence makes me kind of like i want to know the other possibilities that could have arose if I don't play through them, I at least want to watch the different cutscenes and outcomes for everything that I didn't do. Or at least see all the possible endings is something I would love to do. I want to see like what other endings I could have gotten. That could be a fun little video, but... Oh my god, there's the freaking Deviant that we got from the attic. Alice and her dad again. Oh, yes, I was like, please, I want to see Hank one last time. Do it for me. I want closure with Hank. I want to know he's okay. Connor, we're gonna get you a new outfit. You don't have to wear that uniform anymore. Oh. oh my god, I just know. Yeah, 100% this whole time, Hank used Connor as like his son basically since Cole sadly passed by a hu because of a human's actions that's the most like crazy part i was not expecting that kind of story yeah this game beautiful amazing nothing negative i have to say about it nothing 
the design, the music, the acting. We need more. I need more. Just like this. Guys, thank you so much for joining me on my Detroit series. This is the first game on my channel that I have finished. And so I feel like besides the game just being an absolute masterpiece and having such an emotional impact, it's the first game I finished on this channel. Like th this game is going to have a very special place in my heart. I'm just in love with everything about it. And I'm so glad you guys were able to experience this journey with me. And if you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already and hit that post notification bell to stay up to date on the rest of my uploads on my channel and to stay up to date on new Let's Plays that I will be introducing to this channel. And as always, I hope to see you next time. Thank you.